No, yes. <laughs> the return of Ivan. <laughs> oh. Hello. It's a. Uh, it's kind of a rather shocking. Yes. I was trying to make a thunderstorm joke and Dropped it was not coming to me. Got a job as a bike courier. We were playing this off my a game. I was someone Really? Is that what we do on this channel? Maybe. <laughs> she'd never know. And then one day Right now we're getting backstory. A package found me. A package found a courier and then fucking exploded. Thousands died. Five square blocks smashed into rubble. Except for me. And the center. You know why? It's me. Because I had my tray table up. And my seat back in the full upright position. No one could have seen what was coming. Also, I turned into lightning bolts. Back then, Empire City was in quarantine. It had gone Empire down. City! With Otherwise known as not up. New York. Yep. Because for some Find reason we don't want to set it in New York, York, but we don't know any other cities, so we're going Hell to set it in New York and just back don't call it that. And now, we're going to be in totally not a different Kessler. city. Totally not a different city? Yeah. Vision of the future. That looked like a really the gross Vulcan mind meld. From someone kind who doesn't know how to do it. Feet. Provided that I am strong and but I noticed we're starting with the second game. Yes. Is this just because the first game was like, eh, here's the first game in story time, uh, screw it, here's, here's a better game. Go play in from this too. The first game is still here? good. I enjoyed the first game. It just powers. has some I issues with pacing sometimes. So we're going with the better story. Oh, okay, powers. that makes sense to me. The beast is I'm all coming. about story and pacing. And I will be ready. I will be ready. Man, I tell you, Cole, that Agent Quo, she doesn't mess around, huh? The honey badger on first his jacket. Out of town. <laughs> Chick's got some connections. This is gonna be a short term. Honey badger don't care. Just gonna that get doesn't in. mean honey badger don't I'm feel. Get some new powers. <laughs> Nowhere to come right back. <laughs> oh, man, you deserve to relax. So we're going to New Marais. Hey, I need to be back. Is he here still a courier? Up, Just Zeke. no. Maybe at this point, one. Uh, uh, at this point, he's going to the work? city of New Marais. <clears throat> New Orleans. <clears throat> to get uh, to get more power so that he's able to fight the beast that is coming. That he found out about at the end of the last game. The beast. The beast. Okay. Something exploded. Something exploded real good. Vacuum exploded. Oh god. Those used to be people. And then they vanished like frickin' bug lights. Jeez, yeah. what's going on over there? Statues falling down. Empire statues falling down, falling down, falling down. Whee! Use the right stick to look up. Use the right stick to look left. Wait, how do you look right then? Like the uh, left so stick. We had a deal? This boat is leaving. Relax. I got time for this. Where am I shooting? Oh, that's where I'm shooting. Holy shit. <laughs> I'm surprised there aren't police on you like 24 7 with the amount of destructive power you wield. Well, this is after the first game, and the canonical ending for the first game is I'm a good guy, and I saved lots of people. Fair and enough. took out the bad guy. So they give me a little bit of leeway. I also spent, canonically, the entire first game... Oh, you have to stop him. That's the beast, by the way. Holy shit. Spent the entire first yeah, that game... That looks like the statue that just got knocked over. Nope, that's the statue that just got knocked oh, over. Oh shit! Poser! 
<laughs> I tickled him with lightning a bit, and he decided, "Fuck you!" and threw it at me. That itches. Cole, huh. get up, man! Can't have a head on me. Uh. I'm a god of war boss fight. Turn around. <laughs> Kessler told me about you. I want one of the beasts to speak. Happen. She's just like, hello. My name's Melvin. I don't think the beast does actually speak it. Well, yeah, who would want to listen to that? Seeing you. Whoa. <laughs> oh, that's you. Okay. He pause you in midair? Yes, he did. That's not fair. Hold, hold L1. There we go. But I remember you playing this game a while ago, back when this was new. Oh, good. Uh, I don't know about new necessarily, but definitely recently after it was out. Okay, it was new to me. Um, but something that always bothered me about both this and the first game, he's only ever using one arm at a time. And it looks like he's gotta, like, throw, like, a punch in order to throw those lightning bolts out. Kinda. But he never uses both arms. He's only just... Nope. Right, 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 right. And then you're all like, nope, now I'm gonna throw a series of left, 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 left. And for whatever reason, that always bothered me as being really, really dumb. Because he's gonna make himself balls ass tired. It, it makes aiming a bit better. Because you can switch hands and that adjusts where you're able to shoot from. Well, I understood that. It's just, you know, that doesn't mean that the animation has to be so locked into, okay, you can aim over this shoulder or that shoulder, but you if still you got two arms. If you think about it, though, if I, I need to get to a place where... If I'm trying to hide Fuck behind, jumping. sorry. If I'm trying to hide behind a building, and I've got all but my left hand behind the building, but I can look at the uh, look and shoot through my left hand. Shooting with my right hand is going to go into the building, and that's going to do absolutely nothing. Well, yeah, I understand that, and in that case, it makes sense. But when you're not behind cover, I mean, come on, why wouldn't you? I mean, this is this is me nitpicking about choreography in a video game of all things. Pretty but, much. I mean, Broken. what else am I going to nitpick about? <laughs> Felt like the end. Oh, we've we've gone into a comic book cutscene. Almost yep. what it was. So the beast is dead. No. I guess. No. Okay. Oh God, no. He just we just blasted I, him into jelly, and he's all like, "Oh, be he bro. put himself he put himself back together." And now Empire City is dead. It's so, is the reason this is set in not New Orleans because uh, not New York is just blowed the hell up all the way now? Respect or fear because Beast happened. Well, either way, I was alone. I was told to go to New Marais by Kessler at the end of the last game make the world right again because that's where I can get more power. Well, right. But as far as I've been given powers to defeat the. But beast. did we just witness Empire City go ghost pop? Getting floaty pop, yes. Okay. I fought it with everything just I wanted to make sure I I was still on track enough. here. Yes, Empire that City is gone. The next day I went to work. I helped Zeke create a device. It to did focus my occur powers. to me several no, years ago. Do anything to you know, if like if there's gonna be a story about some big old threat happening to some city, it's gonna be in New York. It's like, it's freaking always New York. Why is it always New York? And the problem was I was asking someone who was all like, man, I fucking love New York. And she was all like, nobody cares about any other city. <laughs> like, I don't think you're an unbiased source here. I don't know if you've ever let someone down. It's valid. But yeah, uh, escape 
Most of the time it's going to be New York, but occasionally you'll have stuff set in L.A. Because, well, everybody who makes movies knows about L.A. And... I mean, that's kind of it. You don't see any disaster movies set in Nebraska. Yeah, it's because there's not a whole lot in Nebraska to disasterize. It tr well, I mean, there was the dancing that Napoleon Dynamite pulled out. <laughs> and that haircut that Pedro had. Uh... Not exactly on the scale as oh, some big humanoid lava monster punching New York into dust. <laughs> you know, when you yep. talk to Wolf, everything is going to become complete. But I mean, there, there's even uh, CSI New they Orleans, and it's all about just crimes okay. on uh, not CSI New, New Orleans, there, NCIS New Orleans, or something like that. Well, I guess and um, yeah, it's just Scott Bakula Boy, being all man. like, "Yep." I have, I have a, and sure I have an airboat, right. uh, and there's crime, I hope so. and I'm a cop. Give her a try. And there's fish. <laughs> that's it. Oh, that's I'll the whole, this. that's the whole premise oh. of the, of the thing. Oh. Fun time. What is that thing? I call it the amp. Good work, Thanks, brother. Fun. I laid it out.